How you doing? Ready to connect. I apologize. What? <laughs> I kicked you out accidentally by uh, making my uh, connection way better. Uh, so at this current point, uh, neither of them worked. Neither of them worked. OK, let I me. I don't know it's because there's an issue with the password. Uh, let's do this. I'm going to. I've I've. I've provided Honestly, a bit of levity. I'm assuming someone probably you know, you know what would be a great mod for this game? Well, have you ever played the game The Ship? The shit? The ship. The shit? The P. Oh, you know what I'm talking the about. The P? I see you made made a road with our money. But anywho. <laughs> okay, so basically there is a game where like people are just so everyone's assigned a different world world leader and the goal is to shoot each other but imagine a mod for this game which every player could pick one of the random pedestrians and the goal is to kill the other people without killing innocent people and without getting a shot yourself so now that you mention that i do know what uh game you're talking about uh interesting uh interesting bit of trivia about this game is that the console version of this game allows you to control a person and walk around the city now you can't do anything but you can be a person you can be a car you can be all those things and then you can just walk you around can the city fully control the car uh yes and there are no consequences for you smashing your car into like a school or an old folks home <laughs> or the nuclear power plant yes yes no consequences looks like we're gonna need another freaking fire department uh we should be okay just because it's actually the industrial right next to one i mean it's there's always a fire hazard yes yes that's the biggest fire hazard um yeah, so yeah so i was looking about up you know up the tapeworm oh well, why do you not have water the person is just outside the section of water i have placed a big high school Okay, so there is your there is your water. Now shut the hell up. My school is is so high. High school. Heh. <laughs> Where is the high school? The high school is under fuck. Like go go to the U and go down from the U and it's the big oh, building. It's that big thing there. Man. Yeah. There's smaller versions too. Um they make the sizes of buildings more realistic in the uh, in the sequel. Um, you can create like entire compounds out of like high schools or universities. It's pretty cool. It's a lot. It's it's it makes sense and it makes your service buildings like a fun centerpiece in your city. Whereas here, it's just like, oh, where's the fucking what? Like, find all the fire departments right now without using the overlay. You know what I mean? <laughs> There's only 18 dead people in our cemetery. We need we can fix that. Should I fix that? But but, but before you fix that, uh, allow me to allow the, in, the intrusive thoughts to win. Damn it. Are you trying to place a dam? Yes. Where, where is the dam? That was not the dam. So the dam is in power. You don't have access to it yet. We need to have 10,000 people to have a hydropower plant. Oh, I actually have, an, I actually have another idea. Hold on. Here we go. All right, I'm going to take another loan. Oh, did you refresh the game? Yes, I did. 
Oh, yeah, I still see all of it. Maybe you need to disconnect and reconnect. Hold on, let me block the screen. Best of luck, Oop. Goodbye. Oh, the whole game crashed. Ha! 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 I don't know why also, that's so funny. Also, you can you can apparently just send me a game invite in the multiplayer menu. We'll get there. Yeah, let's oh. connect the in and out to different spokes of the roundabout. Yeah, so you're gonna see what I'm doing, and you're gonna go, "Oh, that's stupid," and and you're right. Fuck do you mean I can't connect it? You know what? I need You know the bus only is gonna be fine here. You really don't wanna That's because of where I'm doing it. I'll have to do it further back. Okay. I need thirty thousand dollars. I don't have that. Oh, you motherfucker. Should I just pop it in now? Why? Sorry, I'm dealing with road segments and... Yep, yeah, fuck. Fucking fuck you! <laughs> Not you. Now I'm going to... There we go. Do you see the stupid shit that I have been doing here? I've lowered the the uh, the uh, electrical budget, and we've somehow increased production. Okay, there we go. Nope, that need motherfuck. There we go. Okay, now I need thirty thousand dollars. No, you bitch. There we go. <laughs> There's going to be a bus route, and the only purpose of the bus route is going to be to allow people to enter the city. So they're going to have to pay a fare at the toll to get to the bus station, and then they're going to have to pay the bus transit fee in order to get over to the city. <laughs> but have you thought of adding five more tolls? No. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. No, we aren't. So that this roundabout so here is specifically to support the traffic coming to the bus stops, and then the bus is being able to get out of the bus depot, which will be inside of the circle. Um, Look at how much better the income got from messing with the budget. That's killer. Oh, yeah, we do have access to transit centers. So there's public transport hubs that you unlock way later where you can basically accept like a lot of uh out of out of state or out of city bus traffic and stuff like that and they have interchanges with trains and so on and so forth um i'm sure we'll be building into that eventually too it'll be great it'll be great <clears throat> so um hit the escape button to go to the pause menu yeah click city statistics okay there you go you're welcome I have spent $30,000 on a bus depot. Now, where's my bus only roads, bitches? Landfill is getting It's killed. literally only the ex the damn expressways. Okay. Why is there a bunch of rocks in the water? 
Uh, cause that's that's where rocks go. Don't haven't you ever looked in the water? There's a rock there. So I have a question for you, and I have a question for chat. Are you there? What's Did the you question? die? No, I'm here. What's the question? Okay, you're alive. Okay, so the question I have for you with regards to this game and any other simulator game and 4X games and so forth is look at how much time has gone by. I think we started in 2020. I think we started in 2020. It's, no, it started with with the exact date of today. Oh, okay. It started as September 18th, 2024. That's why so it's been it's been two years then, right? It's been about two years. Um, you could potentially go through hundreds or thousands of years in these games. Um, who the fuck is... Who are we controlling this shit? the one that you're afraid to take outside. I guess the mayor... Okay, so, so, but is the mayor immortal? Just multiple mayors, I guess. I left my home country when I was in my 20s. Coming to a new culture Where'd all the energy production come Over from? the years, I noticed how I absorbed parts of the American culture. The personality I have today is the result of that fusion. I believe that I influenced America. Shit, come on. on a meta level, there we go. Same kind of absorption is taking place Putting in the K and prepping the area. And the planet will change too, developing according to its varying culture. Next track, please. Okay, well that costs money, but better to do it. Costs a lot of money, but better to do it now than do it later. Shit, that's not what I want at all. Son of the bitch. Okay, so we've got softened terrain, we've got level terrain, we've got shift terrain, and we've got slope terrain. I'm sloping the terrain. I bring the what did you call that? A K? Yeah, K. Q U A Y. It's pronounced K or Key. Looks like it should be Quay. It does look like that. Quarry, you know? That that's a, a very common misconception. Can we blame the French? Uh, uh, the electrical wires are not connected. Oh, I don't have enough money. That's okay. And what do you mean okay, not connected? Money Where? What? Across the water. Oh. Yeah, they are. Yes, until you hit the section that's not on the water. The no, part, it's fine. No, this side. Uh, it is connected. I will. It is not on my screen. I am setting you a screenshot. Well, that is a you problem, sir. Oh, on my screen, it's blocked by the K. Ah. Yeah, that is uh, that is not the case here. We are good. You would see the uh, the tolls and everything would not be um, there would be problems there. Mine is showing problems. Oh no, I mine is not. Shot. I know yours is not. So hold on, I'll leave and come back. Four lane road. Four lane road. Four lane road. Three lane one way road with bus lane. Okay. So, very hilariously, TTS gets that word right. Key? Yes. I need $5,920 to put this riverfront road in. So, I think you will, uh, I think you'll find this funny. Um, you can put pedestrian walkways, not that I think we'll end up using them, I think we'll end up using ferries or something once we have them unlocked, but you can put pedestrian walkways in the air or across rivers, like you could put like big basically pedestrian bridges, right? So we could potentially just leave the um, word that I cannot think of, we could leave the, um, 
uh, the old city alone and still allow our uh, uh, people to access it. No, I don't think we can put in a toll road. Man, Link Spot's going nuts. Good. What has Link Spot said? You should say it out loud. Uh, story mission one AC cancer. Take under 5,000 damage. Destroy all enemies. Complete the mission where I felt rather comfortable using a life insurance for a Spanish song. Uh, seems completely reasonable. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what the problem is. And then I'm gonna put... No, give me the stoop. Get there. And there we have it. We now have a part of the city that is only accessible by bus. <laughs> and they have to pay a toll to get to the bus. So stand by, stand by. Um, Amazing. Let's place... Let's place a basic grid area here. The desync is strong with this one. Worship! Okay. So what are you doing with these roads that make them pedestrian only? Um, they are not pedestrian only. I cannot explicitly set these roads to be pedestrian only yet. However, if you want to, uh, go into the uh, go into the 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 district that's set there. Uh, cars are for shit fucks, um, and then click on the policies menu, and you have access to city planning. Where as of right huh. now, you can implement a heavy traffic ban. No heavy transport vehicles allowed. Does not affect highways. So what is it? So isn't a heavy transport vehicle only like big trucks? A heavy transport vehicle is big trucks. Um, I don't know if we can ultimately get exactly where we need to go with this, but we can get close. Um, in what is the word I'm looking for? Where did all the ones I want? Where did the one I want go? Where's my big booty? Fuck. Oh, here it is. Okay. Um, the ability to ban vehicles from uh, existing outright uh, is, uh, it belongs to a uh, DLC uh, for the game. So if I put a district around the industrial and choose the policy for giving out smoke detectors. Will that fix the fire risk? It will decrease the chance of a fire. Does that make sense? Uh, yes, because what it said was that it heavily decreases fire risk for the area. Gotcha. Okay, so I have placed uh, our first residential blocks over there. Nothing is being built currently, most likely because people can't access. Um, the reason they cannot access is because even though there is a uh, there's a bus service building there, we don't have a bus line set up. Uh, would you like to go and set up the bus line? How? So go into the transport menu, mm -hmm. and then the leftmost option in the bus thing there is bus line. Do you see that? Yes. So what you can do with the bus line is you can create a line in one place and then essentially what you'll do is you will click in other areas where you want to create stops for that bus line my recommendation would be to basically create a basic line that kind of weaves through there and then comes back and ends in the same place that's the other thing you have to end the bus line in the same place it started ah, people are already building there Well, uh, well, I put two rooms. Beautiful. One, uh, one half, one the other half. Gotcha. What you could also do is you could have two routes that follow the exact same path, but one goes in one direction and the other goes in the other direction. Obviously, they'll have Why to stop. Why are there so many buses? Uh, because there are. Uh, they're du they're dumping out all 14 buses on the route to basically make sure that there are enough um, There's crime. bus connections. Oh, yeah, well, of course. There's no fucking police station. <laughs> I'll, I'll work on it. 
Uh, I don't think placing something over there will allow them to actually uh, address crime over there because the only connection is a road that's bus only. <laughs> Oh god, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> you can't off. And we can't just give them their own police station. So great news. You know what? People I... are just gonna have to understand they're getting mugged up, mugged on the bus. Hell yeah. So great news, it doesn't look like there's any vehicles yet. I guess because there's nowhere to drive to. Yeah, do I expect we're going to have to fight fucking vehicles? Like, yeah, 100%. It's an impossibility. I guess we should put a fire department next in our clinic. Um, let's let the area build up before we overload it with services. I love you! Hey, thanks for the follow, Julie Frank. I appreciate it. Hope you're enjoying the content. Welcome in. I'm not seeing cars. So here's the big problem. Um, trucks. There will be isn't trucks. That the, isn't that what the heavy transport ban is for? So the heavy ban, the transport ban will ban trucks. However, if we put... Um, It'll, will it ban the buses? If we put industry... No, 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 no. But if we put industry on this side, the industry needs to use vehicles to offload its goods it's fun okay i see i see buses i still see no cars should i just slap a landfill at the end of phillips street or should we just go all the way over so my thought was that i was going to take that road and pull it all the way over yeah, and make that the industry area but i suspect we are going to have to put um words i can't think of we are going to have to put uh, landfills and stuff there. We have many milestones to go before we can afford incineration plants. I mean, in theory, we could just nuke the entire prior side and just make the entire one side just an industry pollution wasteland. We could absolutely do that. Um, we'll just need to be able to get the goods from that side over to the other side. Do we actually have to? Um, I don't know. I, because I don't think we do. What I've seen is those people are happily living there, having zero access to the other half at all. So they do have access. They just have to take the highway out of the entire area and then take... Exactly my point. That's how we can leave it. We can just leave all... We can just nuke everything else here, make it entirely industry, some fire department so it doesn't burn down, and... That's not even a long commute. You take a bus to the bus station and then just freaking materialize your car out of nowhere and drive away. So what I would prefer, actually, is mass transit on that side and mass transit in between the two in the form of potentially a ferry across the water. Ah. We can do a ferry across the water. We can do a metro line across the water. We can do trains across the water. And my hosting is too. Cool. Is actually a good idea. Yes. Yeah. So we can quarantine. We can have uh, we can have Blade Runner on one side, and we can have um, a Utopia on the other side. That's actually a pretty freaking funny idea. What is Blade Runner? Oh God, I forgot. It's a movie. Uh, it it's it's it is like the cyberpunk movie. God. The things you have missed out on. I thought they made a cyberpunk movie. I thought they just made that terrible TV show. No, cyberpunk, the genre. You fucking motherfucker. I, I will stab you. What's that building? There's what building? That's someone's house. Yes. Uh, click on it. This house right here. I saw that. Yes, I see that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's what you get. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you look at the bus depot, there are vehicles pulling into the bus depot. And then the people are... No, the freaking Mars radio station in-game was giving me a cell phone ad. Oh. Oh, so I shouldn't have had the routes actually going to the bus depot. Yeah, so you could put, you could put a route basically right on the other side of the road by that, that bus lane there. 
and you can go into the you can go into the thing and you can pull it over. I don't see many people walking. Let's see. We don't have we don't have access oh, to oh, like. Oh, I see people walking. Yeah. Yeah. I see I see someone walking the dog. No cars. No cars. No cars. So if you go to city statistics, you can. Is it here? No. Uh, uh, city statistics does not have a transit thing. But if you click on the transport uh, menu in the bottom, it'll pull up a menu of how many people use transport per week up on the top. Seven. Yeah. Meaning all of them are coming here and they're just never leaving. Yeah. Fine by me. <laughs> so I guess do you want to fill out the population or the residential for the other area? Honestly, we need industry to get more people in. You should absolutely dezone some residential from one side. And then we can, can do that. have them populate on the other. It's not letting me change the zoning. So what you do is you highlight the the zone that you're trying to fill in right yep. click it to dezone it then click it again to zone it there uh, you go i would say don't go crazy yet i worry that we would have an issue with people not moving back in fast enough and losing some of our uh, weekly income not that that's the biggest problem in the world right now but better safe than sorry So another thing we can do is we can actually expand our area. Do you see the uh, the globe above the timeline on the yes. bottom left there? Yes. Click that. It did mention about paying, but it didn't say how much the other areas cost. So if you click on one of them, it'll tell you the price. The price is trivial. I got your message, Julie. I'll take a look into it later, okay? Thank you. So if you want, you can buy that area to the left of cars or for shit bucks. Uh, and we can then expand out that way. So I'm zoning the industry to give them smoke detectors. Should I also give them them recreational use on the job? Sure. Because <laughs> it increases tax income. And tourism for the factories. <laughs> Let's go look at these factories, kids. <laughs> and then they freaking show up and they just be, they're just given recreation. <laughs> we have to leave fuck. <laughs> it's too perfect. Fuck. So that... No, I guess that was a little while ago, huh? Good. And there's a 10% interest. Yeah. Oh shit, I almost connected. I almost connected the city, the the uh carless city to the main drag. I almost did that. I almost screwed up, man. Could you imagine the repercussions? Yeah, we would have had to have start putting landmines on the roads. I wish that was a thing you could do in the video game. Have you tried? Yes. Oh, we are we are actually over time. Oh, are we? You're having so much fun. <laughs> I know we are. All right. Well, we actually oh, managed continuing this. Yeah, absolutely. At some point here in the near future. Maybe make it a weekly thing, I don't know.